Hi, welcome. I was uh, developing, developing here on uh, Xmonad and um, I realized that uh, I don't think we have a uh, simple tutorial how to create an account. Well, we might have. So anyway, here it goes. How do you create another account for users? So this is Dries, as you see, uh, the name of my son. And I'm logged in already as Dries. So where am I? Well, of course, in the home of Dries, right? But um, how do you quickly create another person, uh, user, and then log out, log in via LightDM and come back into that account? It's already, of course, explained online. You go to Article XD, and all you need to do or need to know is that we have also a phase five. And in phase five, we take steps, step by step. And down here, there is somewhat something to copy paste. This is basically what you need, except the Eric. You don't need that one. Copy. And then Control T, Control Shift V, copy paste. Of course, forgot the name. Let's take the name of my other son, like so. But it says it's denied. Yeah, why? Because when we're working on Archlex, we are pseudo all the time. So can, cannot lock that. So, okay, fine, no matter. You can do it. I know you can. Pseudo, right? And then he is created this person. If I type it correctly, because the password of Dries is Dries, of course. All right, so I've created my account. What I should also say is the password. It says down here, we, uh, if you forget to set the password, you just can't log in. Simple as that, that's just what I did. So the password for Tone is I want to change. Uh, he asks my password. So that's actually the one from Dries. Um, no new password, no, sorry, it's not. So, okay, then it's twice Dries. So I'm gonna change it again to something normal, like Tone and Tone. So now we have a new user. That's all it takes, a copy paste on here, thinking, oh yeah, I need to be sudo. And don't, shouldn't forget also to set the password again with sudo. And then we log out. And in the meantime, I have three persons here. So Dries with password Dries, Eric with Eric, and Tone with Tone as password. And that's it, basically. So no need for any graphical kind of applications and GUIs, because basically, this is what they do. Nothing more. All right, enjoy.